I don't think any of us have ever seen this before. So let's talk a little bit about the risks. I think he was really scared. He was really scared, yeah, and his mom, you could see, was scared too. These are children whose families have pretty much given up because they're in countries where these surgeries are not possible. So they believe their children had a death sentence. Kids have always made me laugh. My passion are the ones that are in need. The Children's Heart Project is so touching. To take a child and transform its life, to give a child possibility to live, is just a remarkable cycle from the beginning to the end. Samir's purse has just become such a big part of my life, but now I want to be more a part of it. Today was one of the, probably the most unbelievable days I've ever had. How long is this journey going to take? I want to get to go to Mongolia. Approximately 30 hours. I am ready to go to Mongolia. 30? Nobody told me it was 30 hours. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for having any more Mongolian food. It's going to throw me over the edge. Not only does God work on their hearts, but it's a heart project for the host families as well. Lord, you, you worked on my heart while you fixed theirs, and I didn't even know it. These Mongolians have traveled a good third way around the world to hand their child to us and say, I trust you to stop his heart and start it back up again. We think we've seen it all and then we see something we've never seen before. It doesn't matter if you have 10 children or one child. This is your greatest gift that you're handing off. These procedures are risky. Any kind of open heart surgery is gonna be risky. This is an emergency. You know, you're going into somebody's heart. You're, you're taking a knife and you're cutting. There's always a risk that the child will not make it through the operation. She said, if he's a saver, he's going to take care of my son, so why I should cry? And to hear a mom and dad wail in the hallway, everybody knew what had happened. Children. And she said, if they would need my blood, I'm willing to. <laughs> They're so in love. They're so in love. We're ready. to provide this family not only with physical healing, but eternal life. And that is the best feeling of all.